I agree entirely with the statements that have been made across the country. And I want to say that as, a, as the Deputy President of Kenya, I understand full well the folly of ethnic bigotry. I understand full well the folly of tribal zealotry. And I want to say for the avoidance of doubt, I will not be invited to the politics of ethnic mobilization and tribal arrangements. I am beyond that. I am the Deputy President of Kenya, and I will serve and do the politics that unites every citizen, irrespective of their community, their race, their religion. And I want to tell every citizen in Kenya, they stand the same chance, every citizen, as a person from my family or my community. Every Kenyan is equal. And therefore, I will not backslide into the politics of tribal arrangements. I want to say for the avoidance of doubt that I supported my friend Uhuru Kenyatta not because of his community, not because of the language he speaks. And as President Kenyatta said yesterday correctly, he has no debt to nobody. He doesn't have my debt. Uhuru Kenyatta owes me nothing. He owes no community nothing. There is only one debt that I share with Uhuru Kenyatta, and that is the debt of uniting this country and undertaking the transformation that will see the lives of Kenyans change and the welfare of our nation moved to the next level. That debt, I intend to do the best I can to support Uhuru Kenyatta so that we can pay that debt. In fact, if there is any debt, it is the debt that I have, the debt of gratitude to the people of Kenya who gave a simple person like me the opportunity to serve as an elected deputy president in Kenya. And therefore, when I defend the Jubilee track record, and which I will continue to defend on matters to do with road construction, on electricity connection, on connections of water, on technical training colleges, and on all the other things this administration is undertaking, I am doing, I am defending the Jubilee track record from whatever place, including on top of cars, because we were elected jointly with President Uhuru Kenyatta, and we have that debt to pay to the people of Kenya.